Since the 1980s, we've been hearing about kicks or jumps of the cue ball on contact with the object ball. After about the 10th frame of a game, a kick happens when the cue ball and object ball do not make proper contact centre to centre. Many explanations have been offered, ranging from temperature, fine chalk dust, uneven ball surfaces, even static electricity. But they're missing the mark. The current referee's triangle was introduced in the early 1980s, a design featuring wheels on the underside that along with the heavy stack of red balls are run between the bottom cushion pink spot time and time again during the course of a game. This causes microscopic furrows in the cloth surface imperceptible to the human eye, depressions that can affect the height of the cue ball and the object ball at the point of contact, so they do not make that essential centre-to-centre -center contact, causing a skip or a jump, as was suffered by Ronnie O'Sullivan in the Snooker World Tour 2024 in Manchester. The ultimate snooker triangle has a pointer to target the pink and a laser light beam for perfect alignment with the black spot, so the reds can be virtually racked in place. So no disturbance or abrasion to the cloth surface, and no more kicks. It's not expensive and can replace every triangle in your club. This is the ultimate snooker triangle.